Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Wasteland 3. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it shows to join me today as the soundtrack goes up and down in volume in this area. We got somebody called Pico over here. That could be just a model number. Hi. Uh, one sec. Just thought of something. The slicer dies her turns and whistles softly to a hologram several feet away. The hologram flails its arms in a pantomime of rage. Okay, okay, sorry. My name's Pico. I'm working on something, a game, a simulation, really. It'll teach the commune to, uh, fight. What programming language are you using? It's, um, mine. I made it up. I couldn't type with the blades, and they didn't have any wires long enough to reach my ports, so I, uh, whistle at the computer's microphone. The audio signal has the code in it. He whistles at the hologram again. I wanted to make a realistic simulation. A dangerous battle that prepares us for the real thing. We can't keep pretending that the world will leave us alone. Would you like us to help with your game? Oh, yes. Getting data from a real human would be wonderful. Historically, at least some robots have been able to harm humans. So I must be doing something wrong in the simulation. Um, thank you. The game runs on those terminals by the wall. We can begin whenever you're ready. Let's do this. I feel that first, there's... What? I'm gonna kill first. I'm gonna kill you. And then I'm gonna kill... Error. List coming ally not found. Coming ally not found. At least it's got the debug on. So you're gonna be able to help. When I say debug on, it's the, those error notifications. That's That's all because... You know, it's got the debug on. It tells you what, what's going on if there's an error. Which is not how you should ship software, by the way. Because it's a security vulnerability. Begin game, says the machine to me. Waiting for player two to connect. Oh. A lot of clipping going on. Choose your holograms strategy. Uh, well, I am going to do a rush attack. Hmm, I think I'll... Talk it out. That's... Well... Strategies have been locked in. Ready, set. Round one complete. Player one has won the round. Player two has lost the round. Processing. Next round. Choose your hologram strategy. Hmm. Let's talk it out. The optimal strategy in this situation... Well... I'm sure they can be reasoned with. I choose. Talk it out. Strategies have been locked in. Ready, set. Tie. Neither player has won the round. Round two will be repeated. Processing. Next round. Choose your hologram strategy. Let's try to... I know I should be more aggressive. Well, maybe I can catch them off guard. They won't be expecting me to. Talk it out. <laughs> Strategies have been locked in, ready, set, tie. Neither player has won the round. Hmm. Is this going to keep going? He has a new dialogue when I chose that, so I've, even though the game told me that I had already selected that, that's true, but they, they say different things, so that's not what that thing is there for. Hmm. I think I'll talk it out. Hmm. Well. The optimal strategy in this situation... Well, I'm sure they can be reasoned with. I choose. Talk it out. This game is dumb. Dude! The game runs on those terminals by the wall. We can begin whenever you're ready. Track down Vivis... I didn't get a mission for that, did I? I hope I didn't. Because... It'd be really bad, because I'm not doing it. And also this hologram shouts at me and I don't like it. I'm gonna take your Speaking of which. Holo projector. Flickering holographic projector. Local interface initiated. Would you like to change the simulation set? Say something for me. Fuck you, you fucking robot fuckers. Local interface initiated. Would you like to change the simulation set? Yeah, change the simulation. Simulations available. One, irredeemably evil humans. Two, 
Normal humans who wish to disassemble us. Three, nice humans driven to desperate acts for tragic reasons. Four, error. Simulation set corrupted. Hmm. Tragic humans. We don't know what number four is. I think people would choose number four when they're playing by themselves, so I'm not going to choose number four. Tragic humans. Simulation adjusted. I have a heartbreaking backstory. That's a lot better, actually. It's a, yeah, also, it's a lot better than a backbreaking heart story, which is kind of not at all the same thing. Okay, so we're waiting. Oh, we still have to wait. Oh, there you go. So let's talk it out. I know I should be more aggressive. Talk it out. Tiny, the player has won the round. What? Are you kidding me? Hmm, talk it out. This game is really dumb. I mean, he... Baiko over here seems to be not very bright either. I guess we'll go with the number four. Local interface initiated. Would you like to change the simu simulations available? Yes, you're going to give me the number four. Demo error. That's fair. Reminder to self. Delete this temporary text. That's not what you should do. That's not what you should do. But whatever. You oh, no. eat. What? Please be careful. There's all sorts of dangerous things out that way. Oh, is this the the place that uh, has the bad things? Because we were told to. Warning. What? Potentially hostile creatures beyond this point. Exercise caution. There's a dog. It's fine. Dog is not hostile. Warning. Humans in this area have expressed a desire to remain apart from machine kind. I got you then. Uh, we have an ice block over here. And uh, how do I unfreeze that? That if that sounds okay. We're gonna figure it out, right? Yeah, it's gonna be fine. Do I even have flamethrowers anymore? Should have. It's a nitro flamethrower. Sounds good to me. It's a desert eagle that I need. Well, I see. It sounds good to me. Is that actual? Nope. It is de definitely not good because it's not fire damage. Nuka Zuka over here. Wait a minute. Come again? When did we get that? It's a tactical nuke. Someone made a portable nuclear launcher. It's up to you to decide if firing such a thing is a good idea. Yes? What exa- Oh, the ammo capac- ammo type is technical nuke, though, so it's not a rocket launcher. Okay, I'm good with that. Yeah, flamethrower is what I need, the spitfire over here. Requires big guns, so you're not big guns, you're explosives. Where's your- Desert Eagle, there it is. So, big guns is Anna, or Jennifer, rather, she's Anna. Jennifer over here. Gets the Spitfire instead of the minigun. Sounds good to me. We're going to need to have that a little bit on the flaming side of things. Or not flaming, on the reloaded side of things. And I get, get over here. Let's see how we're going to do this. Because this sort of stuff sometimes doesn't work. A lot of the times doesn't work. Okay, that's it's looking good. And another one. Oh, need to reload. Good. Ooh, that went a lot better than before. Okay, that's how I want that. And let's see what treasure we have uncovered. Pico's playtesting. The label reads Pico's or Pico's playtesting, followed by a series of numbers, each gently scratched out. And also that is showing up, and I don't know what it is. Is that, is that going to show up forever? I believe that is going to show up forever. Um, why did we get Pico's playtesting and it didn't play it for me? Because that was clearly a cassette. What's going on? NPC combat balance table Hang not found. IDDQD, IDSP, Okay, everyone, shut, sh uh, sh shut up. Okay, so we're waiting. Can't do anything. Okay, don't know what that is for. Could be the computer. 
macro time units sent fine. the lot in addition to humans, other dangerous creatures such as wolves and wild dogs have been observed. I don't have animal handling, otherwise I would be able to do something with it. Curious sniff, says the dog. Unfortunately, there's also this terrible sounds that I am sure is of. Looks like the robots haven't cleaned up this bit. Oh, it's drools. We haven't seen drools in a while. Oh my god, who did they kill? They killed somebody. The robots did not indeed clean this bit up. Oh, you mother... What? I think I know what happened there. Uh, I took the shot. Yeah, but no, that didn't happen. Also, I needed to reload anyway, because we got that graphical bug that's weird. So, it's good. Uh, did you see what they did? They uh, are scripted to run towards you, and the game doesn't let you start combat. Because of, of why doesn't it let you start combat? I don't know. You know what I mean? Turn-based games allow you to enter combat without uh, without actually attacking. This game, on the other hand, Hello, does not. Announcement time. The Rangers have returned. Let's give them a round of applause, folks. Why? Looks like why the not? They can't hear you on the radio, of course. But it's the thought that counts, right? And now, some Ow. music. These guys are strong. Is that gonna go away? Because we're about to enter combat. Wow. That... Go... Did they... Oh, is this a Dragon Age style game where they increase the... The soundtrack damage when you're... Or soundtrack sound. Or volume, rather. When you're in combat. Because Dragon Age... The Origins, anyway, does that. And it's infuriating. Anyway, we are... This is bad. This is bad. Let's ambush everybody. So you're gonna stay back here. Oh, they talk? This is the radio, though, so it makes sense that they would talk. Give me a soundtrack that doesn't talk. Preferably a soundtrack that doesn't even have a melody. It's just atmosphere, Fallout style. I mean, the original Fallout style. Okay, let's see what they do. That one's probably gonna die. And that is one shot. Nobody else attacks. No, that worked out. That is a lot of goo. There's a lot of them as well here. And hopefully our cats are going to get out of the way because Major Tomcat is the one responsible for staying in the way. Okay, that isn't ideal as far as cones of attack go. But um, let's see what I can do. Lucia has some shots. Let's get her... Well, actually, wait. Can I get you past... Yes, I can. Unfortunately, oh man, the cats are still in the way. Dang it. Jesus. Okay, maybe from there. I say the cats, but, you know, the animals. Okay, Polly doesn't... Okay, this is pretty good. That is some damage. As long as I don't hit Polly. What a weird weapon. That always needs to be used like this. I mean, it doesn't always have to be used like that, but it's better. Lucia has... A miss over that's 81 and you missed lucky me huh oh yeah absolutely missed two twice on an 81 shot very lucky i am today okay let's bring you over here and let's bring you down i was hoping for better than that but i didn't get better than that clearly uh we have 13 action points which is enough for a single shot let's try to kill you that was not a kill. Oh, I used Danny. Eh, it's not terrible. And now let's use this over here. I could use the special attack, but sort of pointless. I mean, it isn't pointless, but... Oh, poison for everybody. Unfortunate. Very unfortunate. We got three action points here. She just died not very good. Can you attack from there? That is how it's done. It really is not. With the soundtrack going blasting in our ears in the background, it is super not how it's done. Are you guys going to be okay? Because no, you're poisoned. It's kind of complicated. I know. Anyway, I need... That's not what I need. I need to click on the right people. That's what I need to do. Okay, that's going to heal them. Please don't take my interface away. 
Rail gonna to die? I, I think they're gonna be okay. There's the sound as well in the background. This beep, beep, beep. What is that? I was just staying here. Yeah, it auto centered there, and I don't know why. But we don't need to worry about that. Man, there's. I just. I, that is unbelievable. That they're still taking damage. We got toxic spines. That was the least of the toxicity there. Uh. It. Where's Major Tomcat? Okay. I need to heal them. This goes away, right? Yes. Okay. It's just gonna be annoying. Man. Whew. Yeah, I, 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 as soon as I saw Polly be like really close to death and still being like, oh, I'm getting hit by the poison that is inside my veins. I knew I was in trouble. Okay, we got a few things. I don't know how to get to them because we're on the upper floor. We got 40 monies and a burned book. Not too terrible. We have a frag mine over there, a fox. There's just a lot of animals that are nice. And a mine over there, medical crate, ammo box up there. Medical crate has got some drugs and whatnot. This feels like suicide. This feel no, don't do that. Save the game, and then you go into the unexplored. Hey, isn't it? Yeah, tell me about it. <laughs> I know. I know. I'm just doing things. Did we do it? Yes, we did. I saw somebody going the other way, and I have no idea why. We don't need to worry about that. We are sort of going towards the northeast corner of the airport. Sort of. We got a computer. Oh, what? Oh, it's fine. There's a Razorback back there. And there's there's a door. There's another door. Oh, this is not great. There's another razor back. Are you gonna step on that? And of course we have the soundtrack. A little locker. Soundtrack is very confused. Uh, we have a tank armor, level 15. But it's really the armor. Minus two action points! Are you out of your mind? Where's that locker? I think I've already opened it. Minus two action points is brutal for plus three armor, effectively? That's out, it's just outrageous. Back, back, back off. I won't taste good, I swear. Protect Vicky marks nine. Take a shot, fast. Yes, I'll protect Vicky. Why is the soundtrack so confused? Okay, now we're Relatively good. Uh, I don't know who Vicky is, or Vici. Vaishi? Okay. And you're... Oh, are we trapped at the front? We're not. Danny? No. No, we're not. So... We're gonna take you out. With this, 93. I think the soundtrack can be brought to normal volume. So that's that done. We got Lucia. That is pretty good. Although, 64% chance to hit is not pretty good at all. Uh, we can go with an aimed shot, though. In the head. So that always hits. And it was a lucky hit as well, so I got to shoot twice. And then I'll step back. Maybe I can stop the cats from killing themselves, as they all always do. Okay, and then we have Anna, who has a bazooka, but we'll figure it out in a little bit. She can also shoot that one. Uh, and, in fact, that might be a good idea. Let's see. Five action points there. That's enough to shoot twice. Let's see what I can do here. No lucky shot there, but that should be a kill. 72. It is. That is a lucky shot. 72% chance. And I landed it. Brilliant. Very unlikely, as we know very well how RNG works and all that. So, you are not going to step over that mine, because that would be ridiculous. Also, I don't believe... It doesn't seem like the mine is activated, but 
It probably is. And then we have Marshall Kwon. Potentially killing you. 68. No, you can't move. 68. Let's see. Mm-hmm. That, I mean, we knew it wasn't going to happen, right? Okay, a little bit of poison. A little bit of attack. Cats don't step on mines. And the parrot also doesn't. That wasn't a guarantee. And then you can take a shot if you want to, which I believe I do. Holy binary buttock, you're the Desert Rangers. I've got memory stores about your exploits. Sadly, I'm not as well equipped with guns. Much longer, and those things would have ripped me taint to transistors. By the way, I'm V-I-C-I, -I, pronounced Vicky. My creator was V.B. Secto. He's what you humans would call a healer, or maybe a repair person. Are you Vivisecto's assistant? He's looking for you. That's where I remember the name from. Yep, I came out here to collect samples for Vivisecto. Then these things cornered me. Thought I was screwed and ratcheted six ways till you showed up. You seem different from Vivisecto. Aren't you a fragment of his consciousness? Crazy thing is, I was pretty dumb when I came out here. But something about the adventure, the danger, I don't know. But something went click. And now I know a couple new things about myself. First off, I'm a she, not an it. Second, I can't go back to just being Vivisecto's automaton. Well, what do you want to do instead? Well, first, I should get these tissue samples back to Vivisecto. But I need a while to charge my solar batteries. So maybe you could take them? Your solar batteries... I... you... that's not how batteries work. <laughs> I mean, it could be. It's just... I mean, it isn't. The batteries are batteries. You power them or charge them with your solar panels. Whatever. Um, yeah. Once I'm powered up, I'm not sure what to do with myself. I want to see the world, help non-dead people and bots. I want to fend off more wild beasts. What do you think I should do? I could just kill her right now with my nerd stuff. Uh, well, we could use a medical expert with a brighter attitude back at our base. Want a new job? You're serious? Hell, yeah! From what my memory stores have to say about your lot, action will come find me if I'm working there. Soon as I'm good to go, I'll roll down to Ranger HQ and find your med bay. See you soon. Yes, I will probably also see you there when you uh, are being attacked by everybody in the team and things like that. Let's save the game because I don't tr trust the game to tell me that I have the correct character selected. Because we need to disarm these explosives. Soundtrack is just threatening me again with the voice lines. And of course, Jennifer is taking quite a lot of damage. I thought I was going to be able to get some of that. Who's this person? Linebacker helmet. Plus four, five armor. Status resistance 20%. That's proper. That's proper armor right there. No, it isn't. Sorry. The numbers should increase a lot more. I don't understand why the numbers for, for the damage increase a bunch, but not for the armor. I may be doing something wrong. Or maybe not. This campsite looks ancient. The airport structures must have protected it from the scouring winds and snow drifts. Are you going to be all right? I mean, if you die, whatever. But we also have another... Oh, we have dead people all over. That's why Vicky was saying non-dead people. Non-dead people are good. Uh, we have a level 9 revolver called Last Resort. They'll never see it coming. An extremely quick attack that, costs, that only costs one action point, but has 60% hit chance. I... Okay, note from November 14th. Think about it, Doug. Doug is November 14th. Yeah, November something, or just November was the... 
I don't know. Was well, something November the November eleven? No, eleven November, something like that. I think it was like that. And uh, I don't know if I said it at the time, but November is how you say the, the letter N in some phonetical alphabets. Uh, military, anyway. And we have a note from Doug, and that's a lore book. The other one was not, as far as I can tell. They might have been both. Nope, the other one was not. This one is. I pray that three of you, or I pray the three of you, can see through your paranoia. They're machines. If they wanted us dead, we'd already be dead. Diane and I are leaving. We heard there are some survivors congregating in Denver. The bots have given us supplies for the trip. If you ask, they'll help you too, even if you want to stay. We have left you a week's supply of rations. I swear that this food is safe. Please eat it before you starve. Think about it. And I think they did starve. Also, let's look at the weapon, at the gun here, because it might be really good, although it likely isn't. Let's see, because it, 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 it level nine, I'm not sure. It does 44 to 53. No, it sucks. I mean, the thing is 60% chance to hit, that averages out sort of uh, to uh, two action points per shot. And the damage isn't enough to make it relevant. It's good as a backup thing, and it, it honestly probably is a good idea to have. But I'm not going to trust it. It does a snapshot thing. Oh, that's the ability. So it isn't always that. No, it's a normal weapon. It's It does three action points. It just has the snapshot shot ability, which I think I can have anyway, because that's an ability that you get. Potentially I can have it. I don't know. Uh, we have a level up here for Anna. That's lovely. She goes up on her luck or on her awareness. I'm going to go with luck because I tr I did go with that before and I, I then had to replay things when, when those things happened a few episodes back. And Either way. Nerd stuff, that's six skill points. I'm not going to do anything with that. And I don't think I'm going to do anything with anything else. Although we can get maximum nerd stuff now because I probably have a book for that. We also have Danny over here with another level up. And he could go with awareness or coordination. I'm going to go with coordination because that gives him an action point. And then we have three remaining perks because I am just that kind of person. Um, wait, what? what is that? Was that? Buying multiple items instead of just one provides a 20% discount. I mean, I suppose it's not a bad thing to have. Just not something that I pay a whole lot of attention to. Stormer. Combat is all about momentum. If you move more than five spaces, your next submachine gun attack costs no action point. Was return. I think I should have that for, for uh, one as well. Just, just as a backup thing. And uh, Lucia didn't level up, so that's it. Uh, however, I swear I can interact with that. Maybe I can't, actually. Yeah, possibly Kent. This has another lore book called A Mutilated Diary. A Be the Dog increases Animal Whisperer. Uh, it's nice to have increased Animal Whisperer, but we're not using it. Animal Whisperer is very powerful because the animals are very powerful. And if you have them join you, which you can do if you have Animal Whisperer, uh, then they, they fight for you. And it's apparently pretty good. So let's see this mutilated diary over here. The diary of a traveler who froze to death behind the airport commune. Most of the pages are missing. November 17th, Diane left. Doug left. We're better off without them. November 20th. Don't believe their lies. Machines are just machines. We're doing... We're going to be ready. Well, I guess... Yeah, I was right in thinking that... Um, they had uh, died back here. I mean, it makes sense because there was a bunch of dead people. So, yeah, that's going to be that for this episode. I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Wasteland 3. I really hope you've enjoyed it, and if you did, go ahead and leave a comment. Like the video if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.